If you're one to enjoy having a cocktail, you may have noticed that we've encountered a 21st century cocktail renaissance. Not only have bars and restaurants introduced a new and creative source of libations over the past 20 years, but there is more variety in the liquors used for those drinks. With that variety has come the rise of mixology. It's an old term, but in its modern usage, it tends to signify the art of expertly prepared cocktails. And that's what you'll find at a new cocktail bar in downtown Cambridge. It's called Blue Ruin, and Lisa found out during a recent visit that they've taken the art of cocktails to a whole new level while perfecting the classics. In a town with a rich history, a bar way ahead of its time is kicking it old school. It may sound like a paradox, but Blue Ruin on Ray Street in Cambridge is taking mixology to a whole new level by crafting original artisanal drinks while still holding the classics in the spotlight. And I'm here with Paul Dendorfer. He is the head mixologist. You're not bartenders anymore, are you? No, we're scientists back here. We're having fun playing around. Yeah, so what? tell me about, you know, what sets Blue Ruin apart as far as the drinks go. So the one thing we like to do is the freshest of ingredients definitely makes a cocktail. Uh, we're fresh juice and every day we come in here, fresh produce from our local farmers. Uh, from the cocktails that we make, uh, the spirits we tried, we did numerous tastings, find the best quality spirit to make the cocktail. So the fresh ingredients and the right spirit makes can make or break a cocktail. Yeah, yeah, and you're constantly designing new cocktails? We are, we love to have fun playing around. So like our cocktail list plays with the classics, so back in the day, Prohibition days, we play around some new age stuff, but then we had customers coming all the time asking me and Brian, say, hey, make something fun for us. Mm -hmm. We're like, just pick a spirit and we just have fun with what we do. Yeah. And it's all stuff that we have back here from fresh uh, herbs, different spirits, fruits, so everything, but it's a lot of fun. And, and people like to try to stump you too. They do, they yeah. do like to play with us. They like to put mm -hmm. us to the test. Mm -hmm. And so far we haven't failed yet. Yeah, yet. that's awesome. <laughs> okay, so I'm behind the bar. You're gonna put me to work, right? Yes, we're gonna make a cocktail. So okay. one of the classic cocktails in aviation, so it's a gin based. So what you're gonna have here is your glass pitcher. Okay. So we're gonna grab your jigger here. Mm -hmm. So on the, flip it on the other oh, side. Other we're gonna side. go two ounces. Okay. So you're gonna do two ounces of gin. Okay. So all the way to the top. And you say it's an aviation? This is an aviation, so very Ooh. old classic uh, cocktail. Okay, put it in there. And right in there. All right. And then flip it to the bottom side. And you're gonna go to about half an ounce. So we've got the half ounce And what marker. is this? So this is cream de violet. So the creamed violet flower. Violet? Oh, okay. So it brings out the essence of the violet flower oh and gives goodness. a nice floral note to the cocktail. So right there. All right. Get that in there. It's pretty. And Not then pretty. next you're gonna do maraschino liquor. So the maraschino cherry gives a nice Ooh. cherry essence. You're gonna go right to that line right there. So half an ounce. There we go. There we go. And then right. fresh squeezed lemon juice Ooh. to the same spot. And that's, that's it's all, everything's fresh, like everything's you said. Everything's fresh. So every morning we come in here, we're fresh juicing limes, lemons, grapefruit, oranges. And okay. then we're gonna fill a little bit of ice. That's the easy part. <laughs> and then your spoon, you're gonna stir it 20 rotations. So it gives it a nice chill. One, two, three, seven, eight, nine, and nine, incorporates nine, all the ingredients nine, in your cocktail. Nine, 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 20. And then we're gonna do, we have these nice Italian cherries. You're gonna scoop one out and put it oh. in the cocktail in the coupe glass. In here? Yep. Okay. And then lastly, you're gonna strain the cocktail into the glass. So you have your strainer there. Okay, like that. And then I'm just gonna flip it this way. Oh, okay. Strain it right in. Through the spout or on the side? Yep, just like that, yeah. Ooh. So you get that nice, beautiful yeah. purple cocktail. That is beautiful. And what's that called again? This is the Aviation. The Aviation. And I'm here with Doug Kyle. He is the owner of Blue Ruin. And uh, we are sitting in a booth that says mobsters only. What's up with that? So we're in the Mafia booth. Um, this was in the design plans probably two or three years ago to take this space underneath the stairwell and create this great little niche booth. Uh, and here we are. It's yeah. wonderful. Uh, yeah. Custom leather seats and this, this table actually came from the beams in the old uh, space over there. Uh, so it's, you can see the holes in it and uh, it's about you know, as old as this building. Yeah, so let's talk a little bit about this building. It has a lot of character and that's what you were looking for? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, we moved to Cambridge uh, 20 years ago and bought a historic home in the uh, Oakley Street. 
and uh, just loved the downtown and thought it'd be really neat to be able to walk downtown and go to our bar. Mm -hmm. And uh, so this opportunity came up about six years ago and we bought the building and have been renovating ever since. And Doug says they're not done. Soon they'll use this space to open a kitchen, making the Blue Ruin the place to wine and dine in downtown Cambridge. It certainly looks like a fun place to experience new eclectic flavors. And if you'd like to stump the bartender, Blue Ruin has the Mixology Challenge every Tuesday night. By the way, Blue Ruin refers to the nickname of the bathtub gin in the Prohibition days. That's some fun trivia for you there.